Hello, and welcome back to Factory Town. In our last episode, we finished up campaign level four, and we are ready to jump into campaign level five. So let's go to the new game, campaign, and pick level five. Now, last time in level four, we, we set up trains kind of for the first time, and we started hauling around some things from trading post to trading post. And one of the things we hauled around was the health potion, which has this icon. And I don't specifically remember what campaign level five is about, but I assume it's about some of these, making these things yourself, and then maybe the next step uh, toward the magic technology as well. So let's go ahead and start campaign level five. Oh, I do remember this one. I think I remember this one. Isn't this the one that I first tried out my my sky uh, my sky rails on? This might be that one. There's a couple of changes, though, I think I see to it. So we're going to have to get started on this and see what we can find. So our first objective here is to get to tech level six, which is to make uh, antidotes and metal conveyor belts, both of which we know how to make. Uh, happiness, of course, we're going to need to have, we're going we're to be able to step this up as always. Enchanted books are on the, uh, are on the docket here, which are the ones we make in an enchanter using the mana crystals. We also need to earn 2,000 purple coins, which uh, purple coins are made from selling magic items. Finally, we have to build four magic forges and reach tech level seven. We're at tech level five currently. So, uh, the first things we should always do is gear down. <laughs> First thing I always do is go backwards. So we have a lot of things here that we can take advantage of. I think uh, we can we can we can improve greatly. We should see what's available uh, technology-wise and see where we need to get started on that. Uh, looks like we have the kitchens already. Looks like we have uh, six, level six and seven uh, pastures. We have most everything we've unlocked already, so that's good. We don't start out behind a little very much. Uh, caravans we have we've unlocked before uh, we're gonna have to probably unlock intermediate medicine in order to get toward the uh, some of the magic stuff here deep mining is available here for the first time which I've talked about a couple of times this is how you mine stuff underground and then advanced medicine is gonna be needed to be able to make uh, health potions and medical wraps and such so we're gonna have to have those in order to uh, or that in order to work our way into making antidotes I assume so either way, we're going to have to do some, some work. So we have here a farm, small farm, uh, just collecting the grain and shipping that grain to the store. And I think one of the first things we could or should do is upgrade that to be a, a kitchen making bread. Um, I don't see why we shouldn't. So let's, uh, let's let you get out of the way here a little bit. Unpause. Get out of the way. And let's take this out here. Um, we're going to still have to do the cart thing because I don't think we have any belts so we have to also get the belts started pretty soon. Uh, but let's do a mill. And I think I'll do it over here so that I can cram it all in here. Uh, flour. And then, um, can we move this slightly? Maybe get a little bit more. 30, 32, 35. Let's go there. We'll destroy one in the process, but that might be a better spot for it. Then I can also put this here. Uh, we're going to put a person in there, of course, to carry the, the grain into the into the mill, and then we'll get a kitchen going. And this will get us a lot more yellow coins uh, ready for us here. I need to build more houses. There aren't many houses in this town. That's a crazy position for a house. I'll do another one. There we go. I'm going to make bread here. And we're going to put another person here. And you're going to take the flour into the kitchen. And then we also need to harvest the uh, some trees for fuel because we don't have any coal super nearby. There's a little bit over here, but it's not much. And we'll probably use that with that iron. There's some more coal there too. But even so, with that iron to make some early iron ingots, probably better use of our time there. Or, or of our coal there, I should say. Uh, you go here. Let's put you a little path in so you can do your thing. I'm going to replace this path here just to make sure the town's extended there. And then you can continue to cart the bread over. We already can assign a, a specialty to this town, so I think we'll go ahead and do the processing. That's a good generic one to start with. If you don't have a better one, do that one. There's more coal over here, but some iron there as well. I remember this map. Yep, I do. Yep, I do. Uh, some tomatoes back here we could harvest and send into the food mill as well. 
But I think what we should do is probably boost up the production of planks. We're currently taking planks to make wheels. We're taking planks into this storage for some inexplicable reason all the way down there. Uh, I think what we'll do is put down a forester. Yeah, but I'm going to move this also. Uh, you know, you know what we should do first? We should make belts. Uh, let's look at a workshop at the belt recipe, the cloth belts. Uh, let's do the wood wheel one plus cloth equals conveyor belts. And maybe we could do that one out here. There's cloth here, or uh, cotton there, rather. Uh, where else is there cotton at? Is it down here? No, that's pears. Any other cotton on the map? Pause again. Uh, not that, uh, don't, don't bother pausing. That might be the only cotton on the map. Really? Oh, we have trading posts too. We should look at those. Let me finish looking for the cotton first. Cotton picking. That is the only cotton on the map. There is a way to... Highlight... Goods? That's under the red coins anyway. Cotton. No, there's a way to see world data. That's what it is. Uh, crops, I think, kind of highlights the icons or shows the icons. So you can kind of see a little bit easier. Lots of sugar. Oh, here's some cotton right there in that little that little alcove there. Um, we'll save that for later. I think we'll put our we'll set up over here. I think that's a good place anyway. Uh, so let's set up a oops. Let's set up a uh, workshop. Uh, no, we need to farm first. We need to farm the cotton. Put that in the best place we can. I think we'll take out one cotton bush to go. Uh, this will be set for cotton. Make sure that uh, you check the box. Don't click the bar because it'll uncheck these and we want these later probably. So you're picking cotton. We need a workshop to turn that cotton into uh, cloth. Cotton cloth. Gotta always make sure I pick the right one. I should probably put a farm here, though, to take out the, um, the tomatoes, too. And uh, then that workshop goes and mixes with one coming from a forester. You can build shoots, though. Should build shoots instead of using people. Uh, shoot there. Grab her. There you go. Forester's going to chop some of these trees here, and then it's going to shoot the logs into a uh, lumber mill, making planks. And then another workshop making wheels. Which one part am I here? Almost. Almost. Uh, this is planks. This is wheels. And then another workshop making... No, enough planks. Grr, arg. Here, do that. Spend some more planks while we're waiting for more planks to get made. Oh, because this one. Yeah, this is why you don't do things this way. <laughs> Where are you supposed to take the wheels to? Are you supposed to take them anywhere? Or are you just making them for your for, for your own enjoyment? I guess the latter. Uh, let's go back over here, make another workshop. I'm going to do it like this, I think. And then we'll do uh, cloth conveyor belts. Not that one. This one. So we need a worker here for the we for the cloth, a worker here for the wheels. Cloth go, wheels go. And that should at least get us some basic, 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 basic. Oh, another worker here for the planks too. Some basic setup for uh, cloth conveyor belts. And we'll put these into a barn once we have the 10. There we go. Do I want it full? Or do I want it different? We have wheels already getting made elsewhere, so maybe but we could maybe put in the... Um, yeah, I know you need more now. More, more, more. Two more, come on. Yeah, we definitely need to beef that up, but I'm, I was waiting for belts. So we'll get the belts going and then we'll do that. Uh, let's instead, let's, well, let's keep that. That's fine for now, but I want to reserve a spot here for cloth. 
um, or rather two spots. Uh, one is an input slot here, and then cloth conveyor belts can go here and here, because if you have a surplus of cloth, we could potentially use it for something else. And then I'm just gonna put one worker here to take the cloth belts into the barn. Stay there. How about if you just stay? Okay, fine. Then don't go stay there. You and you can each have a path. You can have a path. And you can... actually, you don't need a path because we just made six belts and they can replace here uh, easily enough. That way. And oops, that's fine. Uh, this way to set the grabber and then that way to set the belt. We might need a little bit more production here on wheels, but we can do that later. You can drop off there now. Where are you going? Oh, it's up on a height, right? That's why That's why this guy won't stay in the corner either. Uh, and then we can do a belt going in here for the cloth. And then we can do a belt coming out of there. Although I don't know why I didn't do a grab. Oh, I know why I didn't do a grabber. It needs a support underneath it. There. And then this will be cloth. And then finally, you get retired and uh, you can put in that. Oh, we need a support here too. There we go. That at least get us started. We'll get a few belts going, um, and that'll be it'll make me a little bit happier. So what I want to do here is I want to stop this insanity. Um, you're also set up to do iron stuff, and that's kind of well the aforementioned insanity. Let's um, delete you, delete you, delete you, delete you. Let's put up a take take this out too, take the whole thing out. I'll move it around and then I'll put it back. Let's put this here-ish. And we can put a forester in here. And then we can do a shoot for the logs. And then that'll feed that. And then this can go in on a belt there. And then we can put all this stuff in a barn. I think we have logs going into yeah, into that barn. Uh, let's do let's do a barn here. Um, let's do this. Well, let's do a uh, plank. No, that's not how you spell plank. 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 Wheel. Probably just one wheel. Yeah, in that case, let's put the wheels here. Let's replace this with planks. And we'll put logs here. Uh, wood on logs. Planks are used most often, so we'll do that. There and there. And then I can even take these out this way. But I'm not going to put a splitter here. I want the priority to be on the direction of the roll here, so they'll go straight across first, as you can see they're doing that right now. And then if this gets backed up, then it'll roll on to the to the barn. Uh, so we don't really need this one anymore, at least not now. Um, we could potentially still use it. What do we need? Stone. Now what's going on here? You're putting some stone into there. Yeah, we're going to fix that too. You need to be retired. And I think I'm going to even retire uh, this barn. And then we'll create a new one for the iron stuff when the time comes. I think that's better. What are we selling here? Stone bricks. Okay. Uh, we could probably start selling some planks or wheels too. Another forester in. Put that down here. And that can shoot into here. And we can supplement our plank production this way by taking a sky shoot from here into 
into there. And that, yeah, that'll supplement our plank production. And then we also have, we'll have a nice stockpile of wheels. Okay, next thing is stone. Uh, we don't have mined yet. So that'll come later. Uh, let's look at the R menu. R. Mining needs red coins and the industry books. Yeah, we're going to have to get started on, on the books. Uh, let's see. You can have a path. That'll help that. I don't like this. Wait, you're taking the stones there to store them? That's that's insanity talking. Bring them here. Uh, let's do stone. Stone. Oops. Delete that one. That's fine. Stone brick. Stone brick. That'll help some. Uh, we could probably do some better too, but that'll help some. Okay, uh, what is that? Oh, it's a stone bridge. Ah, gotcha. Uh, we could... We could make... We could pick apples, or we could make apple juice. Uh, where else do we have fruit nearby? Any other fruit? Or we could make both. Really. Um, now is the time where you just kind of do every little thing, and then you eventually get to the big things. That'll cover all but one tree. There we are, right there. Perfect. Covering all the trees. And then we can do uh, we can do a kitchen. We could even probably swipe some of this coal from over here. Uh, let's do that for the kitchen. Apple juice, and that's boosted by the town too, the production town, because we're in the range of this uh, this house here. And then uh, we can shoot this stuff down to. If we don't want to shoot it all the way in. Uh, we could extend, let's do a path, not the not the road, stone road just yet. We could extend this path down this way. Uh, even if we don't come all the way here, or do we still, yeah, we can come all the way here. Um, but we can put, well, first of all, we need to put some of these apples into the kitchen there. And then uh, we need to... Oh, we don't need fuel for this. Never you mind, Wally. Oh, we need to make pipes, though. Uh, maybe we should take some of these planks that we're turning. Oh, grabber needs to go here. Oopsie. Uh, turn some of these planks into pipes or turn some of this into pipes. Um, yeah. Now I wish I had another slot here. I could do what I did the last time and put... Let's do it. Let's do it somewhat differently. Still, let's do pipe here. And for now, I'm going to turn off all of that. And let's do a, another one of these. Can I fit it in here? Yes, I can. Right up against the mountain there, making fluid pipes. And then uh, I'm going to shoot logs from there into there. And then we need to come out of this barn. It's gonna be insane. There. Or out of this, uh, whatchamacallit. Oh, you can't build there. All right, well then, we'll fix it. Here. And then we need to end up right here someplace. Maybe we can do a switch back. That'll be good. Switch back, come down. Well, come, come down to there, I guess. And then, here. Yeah, that'll work. Come up. Actually, we'll just go there then. Why Why bother with the shenanigans there? And then we'll put pipes into there, and uh, we will save the other ones maybe for planks overflow from here. Once we have 100 planks, we could, we could dump some more in there or something else. So I think what I want to do is something slightly different for the extra apples. I think I want to do uh, a shoot down to a crate. Say right down in here someplace. Maybe not that far. Maybe right there someplace. Yeah. That way I can expand this field if I want to. 
and uh, we can let's put it on that height all the way to there and then come down into the crate nope oh it's down a hill too down into the crate there we go and then we can pipe this it's gonna be a while in the meantime we can get another wagon going uh this is probably gonna need some help though let's do some of this that way they don't we're not fighting too much i may change this road too and then you can take apples into the into the uh food store there four at a time and this will just fill up with 20 and then sit there meanwhile this will also fill up with with supplies for juice back to here wow we're making pipes at a slow rate it's probably because we're not picking that many yeah because we're only getting we're not getting any boosting out of this let's do nope let's do this and do this ridiculousness Yep, that gave me 1.1, but it'll grow as the town grows. And then we can also take care of this, which you didn't even have to be a per uh, person ever. You could have just been shoot all along. And so could you have been. Oops. Let's put a well in here. Spend a couple more pipes on the well. And not have enough for this. Do I need to step this up to more workers? I think I should. And this one even also. Oh, it's twice as many logs to make a pipe as it is to make a plank. But then again, uh, we have the bonus too, so that's helpful. Uh, you're still doing this job. I think we could probably save you some effort. Logs are worth two though. I forgot you can use fertilizer as fuel too. We don't have any fertilizer yet anyways, but when we do, almost there. Okay, well, that's kind of the basics. Um, oh, we have fish going on down here. Oh, we don't have any way of hauling the fish, fish into town, though. Well, we should probably cook that fish. Um, and also be ready to turn it into... Um, what's it called? Um, fish oil. That's what it's called. How far can I get down here? Right there. Nice. Come across here and then down to there. Let's put a kitchen in here. We'll cook that fish. Uh, let's go. I think that'll be fine. Actually, we'll come out over the water, I think. Maybe I can put another building in here. Uh, we'll do cooked fish. Oh, I have an idea. Another crazy idea time. That should work. Yes, it does. Belt in the fish. And then I'll put a barn back here. Like that. And then the cooked fish can come out on a belt into the barn. Uh, we just need to have some form of fuel here. Uh, yuck. I could borrow these trees. Oh, hey, there's some stuff up here. Oh, the mana recharger. Yeah. Uh, I could borrow these trees. I could either put a forester up. Let's just put a forester up. Uh, and then I could shoot the logs down, which is ridiculous, but what are you going to do? Um, either way. Come on out that far. Sure. Um, almost. And then you can come out a bit more. And I want you to end up maybe... There. 
That works. You don't need much, so I think that might be fine with just one worker at the uh, at the forester. All right, and we have cooked fish. Yes, we do. Slowly. Uh, another wagon would be good for that. And you can pick up the cooked fish and take them into... Oh, I, have an, I have a change to make here. Take them into the food market. Uh, let's take out this. Let's move this back by one once it's empty. Once the next visitor comes or the next uh, cart comes. We'll do that instead. And the reason I'm going to move this is so that I can widen this road. Because if we're going to have other things going on here, we're probably going to want this to be a wider road. And that might even need to be wider going all the way up there. But that I can change later. At least here by the barn. They can go that way if they want. Um, but here by the barn, it's good. So I probably should have gone out over the water one more tile. But I could actually do. You can stop there. You can suck in that last fish. And then we can do... Let's do the wooden... Well, these are wooden platforms. We can steal one of those. We have to build our own thing here so we can move the building. Here and here. And then this can come out here. And then we can put the grabber back on the fish box. Okay. What do we need to boost for? We need to boost this. And I never did finish the pipe for the juice. There we go. All right, so now we have juice going in. Uh, we have apples going in, cooked fish and bread. Everybody's happy with those few items, so that's good. Uh, we could farm these tomatoes out here we've talked about before and ship those in too. Can I get another farm in here reasonably? Let's do... Let's take out those three to get the whole thing, the rest of the thing covered. And then can I snake a barn through here? Or a barn through here. A uh, shoot through here. Not the way that I have it laid out. But that doesn't mean that I can't change the way that it's laid out. Uh, I can't move the barn, though. Take out all the grabbers. Let's put a new barn in... Uh, can I wait, can I copy the barn? And it copies the settings. Great. Let's go here and here, and let's unload that barn. Uh, you can just do no filter, actually, because you can just load everything up. That's fine. One more. One more. No filter. And then I'll change this uh, ever so slightly to where we have the, the belt going this way here. And we'll have two belts here, and I'll have this space here open kind of thing. And that'll be fine. I'm just going to basically move that barn that way by one tile. Oh, I have to turn this off. Or, yeah. Adjust that filter. Moves fast once it moves. I think we'll do that. And we'll shoot these up here uh, with this next to this, too. Yeah, I'll just salvage this here for a road. Uh, we can do this path here a bit. I'm going to have to change that, too. It's too crowded right there. All right, it's done. Let's delete that barn. Take these all out. We can move this barn to here now. This comes out. Uh, this gets flipped around. Grabbers galore. Oh, I didn't set the filters. Crap. I didn't copy it. I cloned it. Cloth and cloth. Input only. Cloth belt. Cloth belt. 
this can go... I uh, better wait. Because it's pretty full. Well, I could have left this here, I suppose. By doing that. Gonna get me a little done a little bit faster. Okay, cloth is done, so let's uh, we can set this one up now. We can also set this one up here and then drag it that way. Uh, cloth here. Why are wheels so so horrid? There's not enough logs. There, and then take all that out. And then we can do a belt here. It goes back in, and now our cloth belts are back. Uh, and then we can take this chute. Nope, chute. There we go. Straight across to that area. I never set this to tomatoes. Another box in here. Uh, we need to come down by one, I guess. There. And then we can take another wagon. And you can tomato there. To me, to there. Uh, let's take out this here. Make a couple of edits. Like that. Can I get that to go in? Oop. Properly? Yeah. And then I can come down here. Yeah. And I can go up this way. Okay. Reconnected. That's weird. Is that... Oh, that's actually a ramp. A stone ramp. As opposed to putting a stone floor on a wood ramp. Interesting. Alright. And that gives him a little more maneuvering room here. Around this kitchen and stuff. I guess I should have done it over there instead. But that's okay. Okay, now it's time we can spend those logs. Uh, you can go there. And you can go... Almost there. We'll wait for... Oh, I shall just delete her. Stop! Thief! There. And into there. I think the height thing there is just... Or the thing there is just... Yeah. Okay. Uh, now... What else do we need to make basics-wise? Um, we could probably do some improvements still on the stone. But I think we're okay. There are a handful of items here that are in the base that could probably be delivered to a store. Um, we could take some of the wheels to sell. Because we're not really using these, so we could sell the wheels. So let's, let's do that. Although I guess I could just belt them across too. Probably a better idea. And then that way, uh, we're making we're making some some red coin here too with the wheels. Better than planks, because it's uh, two planks makes one wheel normally, and wood wheels are worth three times as much as one plank. So that'll be good. And the next, the rest of the stuff, well, we could bring in that some of that extra cloth too, I suppose. We're going to have a surplus of cloth. Cloth is definitely going faster than wheels are here. But I think that's okay. Uh, next up, I think we probably should start on the metal stuff. Or we could start on the apothecary stuff. We have an apothecary already. Not built. We could build it way down here, though. Why should we build it up near the rest of the town? We build the apothecary down here. Can I get it on the road? No, of course not. But do I care? Where's the rest of the, the cotton at over here? Because we're going to have to make bandages. 
with the cotton too. Unless we do a wool farm, which we could do. Let's just for a moment, pretend that I'm going to put this here by putting it here. Uh, let's put, we'll put a road up the side here. Maybe that's kind of a crappy spot for a road though. Can I get, no, I got to do it differently. Like that. Okay, and then we can start with um, fish oil, because that's easy to do. We already have fish, so we can easily make fish oil. And that's made in Medicine Hut. And I have this space here reserved if I want to put another kitchen in. I'm going to put the Medicine Hut in over here. We'll do that. Uh, fish oil. What else uses fish oil? Does anything else use fish oil? Something else does use fish oil. Ointment uses fish oil and herbs. Okay, and then we'll take the fish also out of here. How did I do that? Right. At this height. There we go, because we're not even using all the fish anyways. That'll make fish oil, and then we can go into grid, tab, and deliver. Fish oil. Blue coins for the win. Well, we haven't won yet. Remedy was just herbs, right? Herbs, water, and fuel. We have herbs. I saw herbs nearby-ish. Over there. But those are pipeable. Yep. I think remedies are pipeable. Let's go into the layer here and double check. Uh, remedies are pipeable. Okay. And we can also do this small upgrade here. There we go. Farm. I'm down to this end, maybe. Yeah, then we can do some more on the other end if we want later. Now, we're outside of the town range now, but that's okay. This is going to farm herbs, and then we will t pipe or run those into a what's it called? Uh, medicine hut. Here. Making remedy. We'll need water. That's easily done. And then we need fuel, which I think we'll start with the trees and maybe switch to the coal later. Uh, coal is a little bit valuable, so I'd rather do this instead. Um, this goes here. Oops, nope. Build grabber there. And then water. Well. Well, well, well. Now grid. There we go. One water every six seconds, this produces one every two, so we should be good there. We can always add more of this, too, if we decide we need it. This is making one herb every three. This needs two every six, so that's actually one-to-one -one ratio there with one worker here. Uh, let's go in here and pipe again. Boom. We now have remedies, too. And it gives us some nice blue coins and also gives us a lot of happiness in the houses because uh, they're getting more experience points every time we sell them this blue stuff. And they get a decent amount of points for the blue stuff too. I mean, even the bandages, which are just cloth, are uh, one experience point. But these fish oil is four and remedies are four blue coins and eight experience points. So those are a really nice combination for this early, uh, early apothecary stuff, those two together. If we had uh, cloth nearby, we could make bandages and sell those. Um, but then we can also take those and combine them with herbs to make poultices. And we combine the poultices with ointment, which we haven't made yet, and, and more cloth to make uh, medical wraps. The ointment was the one made from fish oil and herbs. Is there another place where we can f we'll get the fishery? Like it's a possibility. Uh, is there more? Are there more herbs nearby where we're fishing currently? Nope. Did you seriously pick all the apples off that tree? Off those trees? You sure did. 
Well then, you need more apples in your tree. Or apple trees in your range, whatever. You know what I mean. Uh, I'm going to just, for right now, just do the, the tiles that are um, affinity. And uh, you can have more later if you need them. That's a few more apple trees. Okay. I think we should probably get started on metal next. But I think we also might want to end this episode here and start the metal the next time. I'm not totally happy with the um, with the stone yet. I would like to... What the heck? I would like to punch one of these guys. Stop doing stupid. I would like to, 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 you know, have some have some better logic on that stone, but we're eventually going to run through it all anyway, so we're going to have to probably mine it from over here and ship it in. Because um, we're going to need a lot more, I think. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? I think that's kind of good for now. Uh, we could start making... I'm not going to sell fish. I'm selling cooked fish. It doesn't make much sense. We could grow eggs at a pasture and, and do that. We could do chicken or beef or milk uh, butter and cheese um, oh you can sell herbs here too I forgot about that you can sell herbs directly to the food place not the that's what I screwed up before you sell it directly to the food place not the apothecary um, that should be fine this one's fine uh, here at the uh, at the general store uh, we could bring in some cloth items. We could make shirts again. That's not a bad idea. Because we do have this surplus of cloth here. And we're backed up totally now. Let's do that quickly before we end the episode. Uh, set up a... Um, set up a workshop here. Make shirts. No, tailor. Not a workshop. Tailor. Shirts. And then we need a, probably a support block here and then a belt. A cloth. We make those cloaks and stuff too, but um, those take leather. Yeah. So later. And then let's take these out to. We'll, we'll go ahead and add to this too. Uh, like that. Take these out to another box. And these will have to be belted, of course. Let's do it that high. What did I do? Oh, that's what I did. Go up a little higher. Off. There we go. And then I think I dumped a bit of cloth in here. So we could actually have just a person do some cloth deliveries, another person do some fish deliveries. You're done with cloth now, so you could do wheels to there. There's 12 wheels in there, but that's fine. You're done with fish, so you can do apples. There's also some raw fish in there. And I think that's it for... Yep, that's it for you. You're all done. And the wheels are backed up here, so it's going to be a little bit for that person to be there. But I'll deal with that later. So I think this is where we're going to leave it. We have a decent start on a new town. Uh, we'll get started on iron smelting next time. And then we can, uh, we can keep going from there. Uh, we'll need to work toward antidotes. Which we have actually two of the three ingredients, and the third one is just sugar. And we have that on the map somewhere I saw, a few places, so we could potentially start making antidotes almost right away. I think we just need to have um, another another upgrade, maybe? Uh, that's not the right building. 
this. We need to have um, intermediate medicine. So we need to start our research. That's what we'll do first next time. We'll find a place to start making books of all kinds if we can. We have herbs and iron and uh, trees. Maybe right in here would be fine. Uh, start making books of all kinds and then uh, researching those. And then in the, in the next... Um, and then we'll start working on iron and we'll have some stuff ready to go. So thank you all for joining me and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.